Life-threatening bleeding is a problem that all people can relate to, but it's particularly important in resource-limited settings. Postpartum bleeding is a serious problem because mothers may not have access to trained physicians and supplies. This has serious consequences for mothers, and thus their children. We are developing an innovative technology for controlling bleeding. This treatment can be more effective than others because it can penetrate deep through blood flow and clot blood at the source of open vessels. It will be cheap and can be used by a non-specialist. This technology will also prevent life-threatening bleeding during trauma. My team of biochemical engineers is partnering with others to solve these bleeding problems. We are working with Monica Agutu, Executive Director of KMET. KMET is a network of health providers in rural communities in Kenya. We are also working with Dr. Thomas Burke, who is the Chief of the Division of Global Health at Massachusetts General Hospital. Okay, we'd like to sketch out the idea behind this technology. So if a person has massive hemorrhaging due to a postpartum event or from trauma, we need an agent that can rapidly clot this blood. And so we've been developing such an agent. We've been developing a nanoparticle system that contains a coagulant that can clot blood, as well as a propellant. This propellant will allow the particle to accelerate through solution. So if we take these particles, put them into an aqueous solution such as blood, these particles can release energy and propel through solution. So if we put these particles onto a wound, these particles will fly all over, including upstream through blood to the site of damage, where they can clot blood and stop bleeding from occurring. I'd like to show you two videos of this technology in action. In the first video, in the left hand side there are particles without propellant, and on the right hand side are these coagulant nanoparticles with propellant. In the second video are self-propelling particles containing a fluorescent coagulant. Thank you for your time and considering to support this project.